Let's see if Paul is able to now chat with Simon Gerrans, who looks a little bit exhausted, but hey, he should do after a finish like that. Paul, are you OK? Yes, alongside Simon. Just give him a couple of seconds to wipe himself down, uh, put his hat on. And the funny thing about today, Simon, is a lot of people tend to forget that on your day, you can be one of the fastest men in the world. Oh, geez, I don't know. Um, I'm absolutely thrilled with that. Um, I think uh, I've caught a few people by surprise there, myself included. We've had a really good run into the finish. Um, as you guys saw, the team, uh, what they were able to do today, set me up for that first intermediate sprint. And then again for the final, um, they're really making my life as easy as possible. It's a very tricky race finish here in uh, Victor Harbour. Everybody knows those tricky little corners, holding back and making the right move at the right moment. Experience is really on your side. Yeah, that's right. I've got a few uh, Twitter and unders under my belt now, so uh, I do know that finish quite well, uh, as does Darrell, who, uh, who led me out to that final couple hundred metres there. So uh, that really worked in our favour. Well, what about this? Now 13 seconds advantage. Does that mean you can look forward to tomorrow's stage at Wollonga Hill in a little bit more comfortable style, or you've still got to be attentive? Oh, I still have to be very, very attentive going into Wollonga tomorrow. It's still, uh, you know, we've got a nice little buffer there, but um, there's still a heck of a lot of work to be done. Well, I'm not sure that I can remember you winning two stages back to back in a Santos Tour Down Under like this. Uh, the form must be right here on spot for the final weekend of the Santos Tour this year. Yeah, that's right. I, I really worked hard uh, for this year's event, um, put in a big pre-season, um, and uh, so it's really nice that all that hard work starting to pay off. Well, congratulations. Uh, go and get a new jersey. Thank you, Paul.